also, I have played a tiny bit of the game before. I've played enough just to where you get your first power, which is a handful of hours, yes, but this is my first playthrough where I actually kind of know how the game works, and the first time I'm actually going to try to play the game, because the game came out, I bought it, and I played a handful of hours, and was kind of like, eh, I'm not really feeling it, and just moved on from it, didn't touch it again. And, so, oh yes, do a new game, and give it a real shot, and try and figure out how the game works, all of that. I'm not super interested in the story, from what I remember it was pretty <laughs> But then again, like I said, I only got up to the first time you get power, so up pretty early. <laughs> Didn't really do a lot. And I just got frustrated by getting over encumbered all the time and the maps terrible. And like when you're trying to do a quest it like tell you to go from one planet to the next, and it's just like Oxygen's good. Location Just do what you did last time, and you're fine. Uh, Follow my one simple rule. Wasn't super in love with it. Hella, what's my one simple rule? Listen, Alain. Boss lady knows best. Exactly. Listen to me. Mining's just like any other job. Go steady. Go safe. Go home with a pocket full of credits at the end of the day. Yeah, totally. It's just like um, now I work in the Star Dock, except uh, with more cave-ins, lasers, and accidental dismemberment. Very helpful. Thank you. Ah, you're gonna be fine. Your first out outing was solid. Yeah. And, you know, Very let's be honest, it ain't exactly astrophysics. That That's why I keep him around. On May 15th. Good pep talks. Yeah, and the fact that I can pinpoint a helium deposit from 300 meters. <laughs> Not untrue. A shame we won't find any down here. But the metal deposits alone should pay for our own helium. Hell, after this, We'll have enough jump fuel to bounce from one end of the settled systems to the next. Hey, more minerals, more money. And so the cycle repeats itself. Just no more unauthorized jumps in the house for room space, okay? He's just a big baby. There are worse lives. You know, most Dusties don't even make it this far. I have a good feeling about you. A group hug now or at the end of the shift? <sighs> so, one of these days, Hella? I am going to leave you behind. Again, promises, as I say, promises. Any stream that I do, still not as slow as the opening two. The one Scarlet Violet. Okay. Oh my god, it takes like two got. hours to How get the tutorial. Time? It's terrible. A little terrible. Grab some samples. Let's go. Is up on the breach. I don't feel like getting buried alive today. Roger that. Remember that. Keep your breathing steady and never take that helmet off now. Oxygen processors don't expect you to fall.
No, ma'am. Juice ain't worth the squeeze. Well, okay then. Let's call this one tapped. Why don't you move over to that big thing, Pinta? Yes, ma'am. Two weeks ago, Hello. like actually the, the day they announced yeah, this update, and I didn't touch the game again. Uh, so it's you consider a spike in I was like, a problem. I kind of want to play the game. I was kind of interested in it again, but I wanted to wait for the update. Yeah, because of the gimmick okay, I was doing. Now you're starting to freak me out. Was, Relax. Siri chooses all of our Come stats. On. Getting close. I, I think, think that yeah, everything that. is just. Well, in, we seriously, uh, there's something really effed but up about this. Where is it, Hella? Otherwise, through I'm there, going to I think. play the game as a okay. split you, through you're and experience the game. It's just there. the way we'll it's supposed to be. It. And, uh, um, hopefully, this is not a difficult thing. <laughs> the other ones? So. Um, still getting weird gravity readings. I, I guess that's a good thing. Keep going! Do you see anything? Deep something, yeah. Touch a bunny, sparkly rock. Yeah. A vision. Take it easy. You were out cold. Uh, no physical damage. Mentally, the jury's still out. Hey. You know who you are? New recruit for Argos Extractors? Ring any bells? Any of this look familiar? Kind of where I would be like, I'm just letting you check after we get out of this. Uh, that I would be like, hey, give me some information about how to build the character. What do you think? Uh, pick your character. They look like we're probably gonna have a helmet on, so we may or may not see it. So, who cares? Can I? No. 
really. Forty. I'm still gonna use Siri to uh, customize the look because I just don't have to pick. Give me a number one through forty. It's ten. We're just gonna be up there completely accidentally. Skin tone lower. Give me a number one through nine. It's two. So I went through and did like every single one of these before, but I'm not gonna do that. I think I'm just gonna be like. Oh, I only did that. Two, yeah. And shapes. Right. Okay, well. Give me a number one through nine. That would be three. Give me a number one through forty. The answer is thirty four. Okay. Give me a number one through twenty-three. The answer is six. Give me a number one through eleven. The answer is two. Give me a number one through twelve. The answer is eleven. Give me a number one through ten. The answer is four. Give me a number one through twenty three. It's ten. Give me a number one through eleven. It's nine. Give me a number one through eleven. It's eight. Give me a number one through eleven. It's seven. Give me a number one through eleven. It's four. Give me a number one through eleven. It's one. Give me a number one through four. The answer is four. <laughs> Give me a number one through eleven. That would be one. Give me a number one through eleven. It's eight. Give me a number one through eleven. That would be eight. Give me a number one through eighteen. That would be eighteen. Give me a number one through nine. It's nine. Give me a number one through sixty four. That would be forty four.
Give me a number 1 through 14. The answer is 6. <laughs> Give me a number 1 through 47. It's 35. Is it stubble? <laughs> Give me a number 1 through 26. It's 14. Give me a number 1 through 16. It's 9. Give me a number 1 through 16. Five. Give me a number one through fourteen. Give me a number one through fourteen. That would be one. Give me a number one through four. It's one. Give me a number one through five. It's five. Give me a number one through six. It's five. Give me a number one through seven. The answer is one. Give me a number one through seven. It's five. Give me a number one through seven. That would be seven. Give me a number one through seven. The answer is one. Give me a number one through seven. The answer is seven. Give me a number one through eight. It's three. I say it like that. That was weird. Okay. Background. So that's what we look like. But I, so in that other playthrough I was talking about, I had Siri choose this. I just assigned all these a number and she picked one. But I'm going to actually pick what I want to pick here. Is to be like a space pirate. 
so. Let's see space camp coming. I think I went back because I think I still think most of combat happens on like the surface of the planet, not like in space on like stations or in ships. So I don't think I want to have that. I can get something. I don't think I want that. I definitely don't want that. I don't want the kid thing because I ain't done with that in my original playthrough and I was like, this is annoying. They take money from me and they don't do anything. So it's like, this is dumb. <laughs> and I don't know what all the different allegiances are, so I don't want that necessarily. Shit. Just because I don't think there's really a downside to it besides the fact that the guy just can be annoying. I don't know if I want to bring companions with me in this story. Well, I don't really have to, you know if companions are cool or if they're annoying. Again, maybe when I tried playing the game before, I didn't get far enough in the game to really know. Are they fun to play with? Do they get in the way? But... I don't think... It would be, I think, I feel like Street Rat would be more their thing.
that someone was watching him be like, hey, my dears, hey, what do you think? But now, just Google a uh, random girl's name, I guess. pronounce that. Let's, let's try that again. Uh, I want something I can semi-pronounce at least. Come on. Viola. Sure. This is Viola. almost forgot about your application. The one note I had on your file was Troublemaker. Well, you got the sample. Client's on his way, then we all get paid. You remember anything that happened? Right. Huh. Well, you passed up. Either way, we got what we were looking for. All this trouble for that stupid thing? Never mind what it looks like. I speak of the devil. Just be playing. I just want everything set to normal. Start just annihilating stuff that we can play around with if we have to do Whoa, you don't look good. You got a few more digs to go before I feel like talking to you. Uh, hey, that was my sandwich. I got a yeah. I say something? <laughs> Half the crew doesn't believe Earth exists, but it's still there. Same with Constellation. Yeah, but come on. Exploring the space. That's how that is they sucker you to join. Space we've already got complicated. Fancy pamphlets. Not to them, apparently. Supervisor's log supplemental. Supervisor's log supplemental. Still day two of Argos Extractor's Vectera dig. Restart collective claim ID Beta 7548 Alpha. As far as anyone knows, this is just another ore run. Vectera's got enough mid-level veins to keep everyone working and not asking questions. I told Hella everything he needs to know, which is pretty much He's everything I know. My ship. And this is another one of Barrett's special orders. He made good with the payment for Kazar, even if it was a bust. This time, I'm not so sure. This place is giving me the willies. I think we're going to find... I have no idea what it could be, or why Barrett might want it. But those sweet constellation credits mean we dig our holes and keep our mouths shut. And I'm okay with that. Hopefully, between Barrett's mysterious thing and the ore itself, yeah, right. we'll be done with this rock in five days, when the transport is supposed to come back for extraction. I'm glad when we're off this rock. Been a good run. You lucked out being picked up for this one. I remember the digit pick thing is kind of really key. Actually, pretty difficult. What? Oh, I'm working. Right. 
Hell are putting that first aid seminar to work. All right, Dusty. Airlock, put your helmet on. Sitting in the
Tip your four. Hey, look at that. The watch fits you perfectly. Now, questions? Nah. <laughs> nah. Let's go. Don't good. let her break my ship. <laughs> hello, hello. Water. Captain, I assume you know you know the drill, Vasco. the game back when it uh, first came out and played like a little bit of it but it just couldn't get into it like I didn't even get to the part where you get powers I didn't even find that out until recently <laughs> that you get powers in this game so I'm giving it another shot here and I just started from scratch I don't really remember much about the story I remembered that we are now that minor. we are in orbit, it might be wise to test all it. controls and systems to ensure they are not on the verge of catastrophic failure. I can step you through the entire process, or if you're already an experienced pilot, just power up all the systems and we'll be on our way. Bolts. Bolts. I remembered the controls for this being really weird. More mic volume. Not better. See, like, I'm trying to remember, how do you... Oh, yeah. Here. Set course. Come. And I remember being annoyed by these <laughs> menus every two seconds. Switch this back over. Nope. We will need to disable the 
Have you played this game much? Uh, water lemon. Is that better? He still it still picks it up. And it's still you can still hear it. mechanical keyboard so there's not a ton they can do about it. I, this is another thing I wasn't really a huge fan of. There's a thing in the new update about space combat but that you can adjust the difficulty I wanted to try it without doing something like that first. I'm 
Yeah, I wonder if my ship's ball is getting... The keyboard thing any better? Continual assaults from their ships are high enough to jeopardize our mission. In short, they are after the frontier and will not stop. We will need to deal with the local Crimson Fleet captain. A recent scan indicates an abandoned facility on the nearby moon of Crete, a perfect staging area for pirates. I can be that far away and do that? Cool. And we can go to the next thing. We have arrived in orbit. The abandoned facility with our Crimson Fleet captain is on the surface. Since you played some of this, um, what do you think of the companions? Uh, like this, I think his name's Jarvis, the robot guy, uh, and then the other, or Basco. Why did I think it was Jarvis? Because they got marble on the brain. Um, scan. Uh, anyway, what do you think of the companions in this game? I didn't really know. What's that? Really? How did I miss? Because I recently went back and started playing Fallout 4 some, but doing uh, survival playthroughs, and I'm very quickly figuring out that uh, having the companions with you isn't necessarily a good thing. If you have any tips for, like, good ways to play this, let me know. Where are those little guys go? I think I might want to kill those little guys and get 
Take the you. Well, I might not want to use ammo for that. That's probably a waste. Probably should have done that before leaving to go into this building, but that's fine. Is there anything specific uh, that I should look out for, for like items of value to resell or anything like that, uh, especially like early game? Say if it's a crafting chip. Hmm. I'm realizing I want to move something. Wait a second. This. That's handy. Oh, okay. Didn't you actually read it? Then you can just toggle back out to combat. Does it bring up your weapon again? Oh, it does. Okay, I like that. That is so much faster than trying to go through like every single item. Oh, that's... Thanks for that heads up. Ask him. I want to get in that door. How does the uh, the video quality look? Is it really blurry, or Cause I'm still trying to figure out like OBS settings and stuff. I'm still pretty new to streaming. I don't think there's anything else here. It doesn't look like. Cool. Seems kind of heavy. I know there's enemies here eventually. I just don't remember when they show up. What is this? It doesn't look like it's a temperature angle. 
think you first encounter them up here somewhere. Hello, sir. What happened? Dissembler Kraken. Thinking I'm gonna go uh for the rounds for that too. I'm not gonna be fighting robots right now though, I don't think. Humans. Raiders. Got ammo for that, so. I wish my uh, sneak speed was just a tiny bit faster. Button. a heat leech. Where'd that go? Ew. The heck was that? Here's my tasty. <laughs> yeah. I've played a few Bethesda games before. <laughs> the meat. Okay. Else in here? I don't think so. Wait, wait, no, Imagine. Food That's a lot of money for a little small amount of weight. Take that, take that. Yeah, 
Alright, alright, alright. Alright, alright, alright. cooking in this game too so I'm a little afraid to eat something I might want to try and use later but at the same time I'm like I just need to and then I could also just use a med pack yep let's not have how do you his favorites cute Did you do cooking in your playthrough, uh, Water Woman, or did you, uh, not do that as much? That's, I think, part of my issue when I tried playing it before. I tried doing a little bit too much of, like, everything, and it got a little overwhelming, and I didn't really... I felt like I was just kind of getting pulled in so many different directions that it... I didn't find it to be fun. Where now I'm trying to, uh, kind of like you're saying, I'm trying to focus in on, like, one or two things. Like... I was trying to do some cooking stuff. I was trying to do some base building stuff. I was trying to do weapon building stuff. I was trying, like, I was literally trying to do everything. And I think that made it not fun. And like you're suggesting, I think I'm gonna focus in on like just weapons and suit stuff and just go from there. Gotcha. with that, okay. Yeah, I've heard things about the New Game Plus uh, feature that make it sound interesting, but like I said, I got so burnt out so early on uh, when I tried playing this before that the idea of ever attaining New Game Plus was <laughs> never a thought in my mind.
I don't like the the button to switch the bang and the button to exit are so close together. Really bugs me. Okay, so that's the inside one. So this, these two need to make the outside. There. Okay, that should be it. Oh my goodness. Do in the thing. Seems that way. Oh, really? I didn't know that they changed. I was that one of the updates to the, or one of the changes to the new update about the undo not costing a digipick?
I knew I know one thing from the new update uh, is they added uh, whoa, jeez, uh, local maps. Oh, which actually we should be able to check. Yeah, I shot you there. travel, I just want to see the map. Maybe the maps are only on certain planets or certain stations or something. Shit. Didn't expect him to fly. I searched this guy in there yet. Disintegrate? skills here.
Station. Anything here or not? Our uh, our bandages worth making? like two of them or something. Kind of told you to do multiple. What's all oh, that BS? Oh. Yeah. Buddy. Decreases one's life expectancy. I'm overweight, aren't I? <laughs> I think so, like that's what I was kind of I glance at the uh Difficulty settings, like, and you can change a lot. Enemy combat, player combat, enemy ship damage, player ship damage. You can turn ammo weight on and off. You can adjust varying carrying capacity things. 
Um, and it looks like if you like increase the difficulty of any of these things, you get a bonus experience for it, which is actually pretty cool, I gotta say. And you can kind of customize the game to almost however you want to play the game. Because, like, one thing that I... Uh, I've, I've done some survival um, Fallout 4 stuff, and I like survival. Like, I like the increased difficulty, but I don't like that you can't save. Like, I don't like the fact that you can die and lose, like, two hours of gameplay because you aren't able to find a, a bed somewhere or something. So the fact that it almost looks like you can increase, or you can turn, like, oh, you have to eat, and you can increase the difficulty of things, but still have the ability to just save. Sounds really cool to me. But I'm just doing a normal playthrough right now, and if we end up getting somewhere where I'm just annihilating everything, then maybe I'll play with some of this stuff, but right now, just going with default. Eh, yeah, let's throw a quick save in. Why not? I am no longer detecting enemy activity in this area. It is foolish mm -hmm. to carry so many items on your own. Captain, well, protocol you indigo. Take some of my stuff then? Any and all items. Good. Take all my miscellaneous though. Except for my digipicks. Suppressor off that. Or, oh, it's a rattler, not a. I can just throw that over there. Then. Should be able to move that off. Shit! My oh, damn, dude! Let me say hello. Start shooting, huh?
Okay. Anything else worth taking here? I'm detecting a safe nearby. We could make use of whatever is... I think I've angered it. <laughs> I'm trying to remember. 
get anything for like reading these books. I think you do. Coach and shotgun. As a new captain? You working with Barrett, or did you pry the ship keys out of his cold, dead hands? What do you think we should say? What do you think we should say, water to oh, no, women? No, I can. <laughs>
cute. Okay, I can't see it. No. I can't see a thing. Shit. That was not what I meant to do. Why didn't my jump back engage? <laughs> Navigator space helmet? What in the world? Minus 15 damage from human enemies. That sounds good. It's just fast travel, so no. Trip. Oh, so this is the map. That is better. Captain, to reach the lodge, we must jump to the planet Jemison in the Alpha Centauri system, and then land in the city of New Atlantis. Do not worry, this will all become second nature before too long. Where? Where are you? I'm gonna keep calling this guy a journalist. Basco. We need to reach the Alphas and allow me to assist you with carrying your items. I'm good. It would be advisable to leave some things behind. Sound like that great of a perk. <laughs> oh, I want to take this pressure off that and put that on that.
Uh, I believe there is something about uh, the ship interior, you being able to uh, decorate inside a ship and stuff. Yeah, it's supposed to be entire new, um, like not cargo holds, but uh, like living spaces or whatever that you can use to build ships that have no pre-built stuff in them. They just are empty. And you can decorate them however you want. Uh, at least I think that's what they said in the uh, announcement video a couple of weeks ago. Is that better? That's better. Uh, I gotta get these to the restroom real quick. So I'll be right back.
pictures. I don't really like it that spot either, but this. Settings, hotkeys. Oh, I'm done. That's what I. There we go. Okay. That's the phone keep, yes. Oh, that's... Hey, Water uh, Lemon, do, which is more important, these different uh, resistances, like the thermal, airborne, corrosive radiation, or are your physical energy and electromagnetic, whatever that means, like, which is more important, these four things or these three things? Just have the pirate one, to be honest. Just a bad spot for the thing. I think the idea was for the player to choose right here for the environment. But who bothers? Especially playing on just the standard normal difficulty. Like, after a certain level, as long as you've not just completely uh, made your perks be in just one here, one there, one just in every random spot and didn't double down on a couple of things you get op and you can just walk through the game typically sorry i'm still trying to figure out where i should put my chat overlay and be able to read in game but also be able to read chat <laughs> And so, like, I'm trying to move it around and figure out. So, like, I moved it from one side of the screen so I could read item descriptions, but then now I moved it to the other side of the screen so that it's out of the way of that, but now it's... I can't read 
this list and read chat at the same time now too but i don't want to have it in the middle of the screen for when i'm in gameplay so i'm like because <laughs> i originally had it pretty much where you see chat but that made it difficult to read item descriptions Everything but digipix and obviously that can't go in there. Digipix. experience this game seems to be mostly just hit this button menu then hit this button menu Something like that. And he's your new captain. My crew can take a look at your ship. And you can stop by the trade authority kiosk if you need to offer it. Does my ship need any repairs? It'll land it, so I'm sure whatever is broken can be. Oof. It did need to repairs. Oof. Do it. Do it. So, I don't have anything in my inventory. I want to set up everything here, though, except for resources, pretty much can be sold. Yes, I'm gonna go pistols for the playthrough, I think. So I don't really want any of them. Wait. No, did I just mess up? I think I did. Did I get rid of... No, it's still in here. Okay, good. Ooh. I'm going to have the this because I want to take the suppressor off that on there. Would be if 
Sabas! <laughs> Where's my bell to ring? If it belongs on your ship, then I'm sure we have it for sale. Oh, well, there you are. Hi there. Thanks for stopping in. Feel free to look around. I can take care of Trans. Let's see what you got. Please take a look. Whatever it's called. I remember being really frustrated trying to navigate this place. Like, be like, oh, you'd have some miss mission objective, and be like, oh, go over here. But you're like, I don't know where that is. And you try to bring up the map, and it's just all this blurred mess. Like, okay, great. Which, let's take a look at that. Oh, yeah. That is significantly better. Can I... Yeah, I know I can. Can I put, like, an objective marker on it? I was hoping I could like pin a location. Check the view of accessibility. Sites. Oh, that no, that sounds terrible. Um, I never know what is like a good number to reset this to, though. That's where I get a little like, eh. I technically could be playing this on. I mean, like, I have a wide, ultra wide monitor, actually. I could be playing this at. Uh, 3440 by 1440 or whatever it is but I A. don't know if my internet can handle uploading at a good stream quality ultra wide and B like this I don't know if I would need to change the FOB and if I did what number to I'm always like eh so I, I typically don't touch that. It's good to know that it's there, though. Thanks. Captain, everyone will be in the library, just inside. 
If Barrett were here. We appear to have a visitor. Welcome to Constellation. We have a lot to talk about. Would you care to tell us what happened to our friend? Why you're here and he isn't? Eh. I see. Vasco, verify. All statements made have been factual. Uh, this is just typical. Barrett hands over our ship and our robot to some random employee of that discount mining outfit he uses. Walter. And if we hadn't insisted on installing those emergency protocols, I guarantee you this rock breaker here would be halfway to Neon. But that didn't happen. She's here, with the artifact. Thank you, Mateo. Now, let's focus on what's in front of us, shall we? What happened when it was extracted? Did anyone see anything? Hear anything? Interesting. Right, it's, I guess. Similar to Barrett's description music? of the experience. This voice is I don't know if I'd call it music. Are you hearing this? Do you all believe me now? Whether it happened or not wasn't in doubt. But I'm sick of it. You expect us to believe in Barrett. If this is the greatest mystery in the universe, why couldn't it be part of the ultimate mystery? But gentlemen, can we please focus? Noel. I think it's time we tested your theory. Right. Let's see. We I remember all this so far. The pieces we already have move when they're in close contact. Now, if we add this new one to the two we already have, the artifact. If you could place okay. it on the table here. Yeah. That's it. Just like the others. To imagine, we thought there were only two of them at first. Oh my god, that's it. So the thing I don't quite understand is that like that up until this point no they only had one other person that had visions, right? Barrett, which they don't tell us until a little bit later. I get that, sorry, spoilers. It's the first like couple hours of the game. Anyways. But like he is all freaking out about how exciting the two things are, but they've only had one person have uh, visions from them. It wouldn't be exciting. And not to take away from the moment, but what are we going to do about our They didn't react like this until we brought the third one in. Are you ready to get to So beyond one person having visions, which at that point could just be a crazy person. Why are they so excited? Okay, they're made out of a material that they haven't seen all of existence. There are so many materials that I'm sure became uh, new to us as we just left Earth for the first time. So having one new material doesn't seem that crazy. I don't know. Individually, they're just odd hunks yeah. of metal. Another oddity from the uncharted reaches of space. As to what they are, what they're building. Well, you'll be part of solving that puzzle now. We're all here because we're committed to exploring space. Humanity may have settled the stars, but that doesn't mean we should stop diving into the unknown. Beyond that, you'll be expected to use your own judgment, just like the rest of us. You should take some time to get settled in. Introduce yourself to everyone. Some of our members aren't here, but come find me when you're ready. You and I are going to be doing some traveling together. Get your feet wet. And here, I think you've earned something for bringing the artifact to us. In addition to credits, why don't we set you up with a backpack with some boost capability? Hmm? You'll need it out in the field anyway. Just mind your head. It's, it's great at this one. And we'll get him level up, I guess. 8,000 credits, aren't it? Can't level that up yet. 
done a single seat speech thing yet. Get level pistol certification up though, I like that. Good call. Good call, water lemon. What is that in tech? Yes. I hope Barrett makes it back to us. I know he gets into trouble all like, yeah. the time. And everyone just sort of accepts he'll be fine, but still. Hey, uh, Water Lemon, is it worth talking, worth talking to all of these guys? I've occasionally had my doubts about Constellation as an investment, but now... Oh, it's well, it's clearly money well spent. Is this stealing? Doesn't look like it. Okay. Feel free to help yourself at the bar. I don't drink, but I feel like if I did, now would be a good time for one. Alright. Uh oh. I will take these. Oop. I feel like I've been waiting my whole life for this. Constellation, oh, the artifacts. Are you doing okay? I'm not sure anyone really asked yet. Don't want you to think we're focused on the artifacts and nothing else. You matter too. You've done something really significant bringing that artifact here. I'm Mateo, theological scholar by trade, but now, well, an explorer like you. It's really good to have you with us. Second one was on Kazal, buried the same as the one you found. But the first one, right under our noses for years, sitting in storage, masquerading as an oversized paperweight. Can you imagine potentially the greatest discovery in human history collecting dust? How is it the greatest thing? Like, I don't understand what's so special I really about it. I could have seen this for myself. It's hard to judge. Like, I don't get it. Both you and Barrett saw something. I don't think that's a coincidence. Did it feel like it was trying to tell you something? I don't want to necessarily use the words divine revelation, but you know, if the label fits. Yeah, it meant something. I don't know. <laughs> Others. <laughs> yeah, that's special. Maybe it'll make sense later. We're gonna get to the bottom of this. We just need more data, which means more artifacts. Prepare yourself. What's up, old man? Well, I suppose that station in orbit has more than paid for itself at this point. Well, I suppose calling you a rock breaker may have been a bit out of line. Yeah. Call you... I don't know. Dirt, because you're close to being dead. <laughs> yes, you're right. Yeah. My frustrations lie more with Barrett. Not the first time his shenanigans have jeopardized one of our ventures. Not fair of me to take it out on you, especially since it would seem he made the right call this time. This so, time. Let's start over, shall we? Walter Stroud, CEO of Stroud Eklund, member of Constellation, and off times grumpy old man. Welcome aboard. <laughs> so, kind of my plan with this uh, playthrough is I want to become a space pirate. I know that is a possibility of a thing, and I, I want to do that. I don't care as much about the main story. I want to be a space pirate. <laughs> so, we're saying drinks. <laughs> yes, well, a 
Stock bar is a treat I think Constellation can afford. For now. But if you clean us out, you're on your own. By the way, in addition to a place to stay, the Lodge has a wealth of modification and research equipment. Spacesuit customization, pharmaceutical manufacturing, uh, you crafting. can even fashion industrial pieces for large scale projects. If you don't mind extracting a few raw resources from a nearby, I don't know how I'm much I'm really going to get into. So I encourage you to make base building. To build what you need. What do you think of a settlement building, base building mechanic in this water lumen? We can always. Up until very recently, I'd likely have dismissed it as. I don't know, hallucinations. But now, I'm not sure what to think. I don't suppose you have a history of this sort of thing, do you? What, hallucinations? Ah, okay, good to know. Is it worth making multiple bases, like multiple planets, or... Is it just worth having just one so that you have one to go to and do stuff at? Of course, I'm asking these questions. You played it when it originally came out. Maybe there's updates to that whole system in the new update. I, I don't really know, so I'll have to check it out. At least a little bit. <laughs> Not super interested. I'm in not it. getting any younger either. Hey, chill, dude. You, you can let us talk. So rude. Not exactly, no. But I suppose it doesn't matter. You saw something. Barrett saw something. I'm no scientist. I leave that to the likes of Barrett and young Noel there. But I think we can all agree there's something unusual going on here. Yeah, that's kind of what I got the impression of the basis. Me? <laughs> Why, I'm the wallet. Yeah, I got that. to fund all this and all my success. In... I don't pretend to have the daring of Ms. Morgan or the smarts of young Mateo, but I can make it. And as you've now seen, those resources... The most well known for ship manufacture. No expense spared. If you want the best and can afford it. Unfortunately, our success means you'll sometimes see Stroud Eklund ship modules on less than reputable vessels. They covet them. The bastards. I've tried to convince the United Colonies we can help. That's them. what I've kind of heard. I'm married to uh, Star like, I've Those seen are stuck in the uh, pictures and videos about shipbuilding ever since the game came out and that seemed cool but also a little daunting at the same time <laughs> until next time as much as i love uncovering new questions i wouldn't mind so are you ready to get to work or was there something else so From what I understand, we need to kind of do the main story up until you get powers unlocked so that the game like really kind of opens up. Is that true or is it worth going doing some of the side stuff now before continuing the main story? Because, like, I honestly didn't even know you got powers in this game until, like, a month ago. Because <laughs> uh, when I originally played one. the game, I didn't even get that far into the game.
Alright. Um, I kind of want to get the basement of the Bye. lodge open, which I think you have to do. Oh. Or not. Oh, okay. I didn't think I could go down here yet. Never mind. anyway so I won't take this all off okay I can okay I see oh really That's the only reason why I kept this weapon. That sucks. Is there not another research thing down here? Did I ever fix this glitch? anymore. There really isn't a research thing down here? It's kind of surprising. 
few printable. I want pistols. I don't want to be a rifle. I want to be a That's the eventual plan, I just... That's cooking today. There. Basement. Yeah, I thought there was one downstairs too, but I didn't see one. I am at your service, Captain. So I thought they had all the different stations down here. And I thought every they had all the stations down here. They have every single one but research. It's kind of weird. Middle of the first basement room. Yep. I walked right past it the entire time. Good call, good call. Do I have any of these things? No idea what that means, but... Earth Cuisine, too. Stuff. I don't know if I need to do this. Med packs or ammo, even after unlocking it all. You can't make med packs? Really? Yeah, that's kind of dumb. Well, that's the. I don't think you can make ammo in Fallout 4 either. You can in 76 and New Vegas, but uh, yeah. Even in survival. So I don't think you can.
Wait, get that stupid thing. That's really like great of a shot I could. Upgraded any of this stuff because I'm probably gonna find something better just on my own here soon. Do I have anything I could look? Dude. some free experience by getting a tour. It's been quieter around here ever since Vladimir went to live on the eye full time. That was intense, wasn't it? The artifacts, I mean. I guess a lot overwhelming, now that I think about it. I'm Noelle. It's really nice to meet you. And thank you for bringing the artifact to us. Yeah. The the leveling system is kind of strange. I still not sure how I feel about it. I mean, I, I like that it's leveling like stuff as you use it, but it I don't know. It's kind of weird. Planning on sticking around then? Good. I think we can find a spot for you. And along the way, I can give you the very abbreviated... Yeah, come on. Let's go. Come on. I trust you're Let's still go. Satisfied <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> yes, ma'am, of course. I honestly can't imagine being anywhere else. Just making sure, right young girl like you, there are no shortage of opportunities. <laughs> yeah, I can understand that. that. But if I weren't here... I wouldn't even know about all hey, the incredible things. Hey, I thought I told you to... I thought we were doing the thing. We were doing the tour. Ever since I got here, this has felt like home. These people are family. Stay safe, okay? Hey. 
bath while we were doing our uh We've always tour. considered ourselves explorers, but this really isn't see you later. What's going on? Okay. I hope you are satisfied with the quarters available. I'm sorry, I really can't afford to be distracted. I need to get to the bottom of this. Seen me staring at truth. I am not staring, I am analyzing. This is important xenobiological work. I work for the scientific division of MAST. I've been studying this. Are you familiar with this particular specimen? Do you understand its importance? Look, I have a lot of work to do here. A tree? If you're just going to gawk, I'd ask that you move on. If you can actually assist me, however, I would appreciate it. I don't normally solicit help from random passersby, but it seems an exception. A mercenary, huh? Well, I'm sure we can Kim. work something out. Kim. So, are you on board? Uh, Thank you. That's unexpected. Ah. There's a series of biosensors I've placed in various locations around New Atlantis, all calibrated to gather pertinent information. They've been running for long enough that I think it's time to collect and analyze their findings. If you would bring them to me, that would save time. So, did it just change color? Yes, good. This is like one of the last, I remember this quest, and I remember this tree quest thing. I don't remember the full into it, I remember doing what I'm doing right now. And I remember going back to the mine that you get picked up at, to uh, where you meet up with Baron again. That's how all I remember from my original playthrough. Then I did one other playthrough where I tried uh, to do this like random every single stat have Siri pick it thing and I did pretty much the same distance in the gameplay except instead of doing the Barrett quest I did the quest that you go get your first power at and that's all I've played. Okay, let's see how this map works. Can I fast travel to something closer? 
no, because I haven't been to any of these places. This place is kind of closer. I'm going to pass right there. Interesting. too i've only found one so far but i want to find more before anyone else does so eggs you something, can you tell me we also kind of look like a weird sperm I don't know. yeah it was weird right miss Seng over at uc distribution bought the one i found and she said Now I can go straight up there, I think. Please, if you experience any issues in your dealings with the distribution center, let us know. Welcome to UC Distribution. Now I have been told it'll be up and running in two weeks, but you know how these things... Also, if you're here about a corporate account, I've been assured that deliveries will be back on schedule soon. Mm. Who, Jordan? That kid's in here every other day with... Why, what is it? Check so, it must mean something to you if you came looking for it. Well, you can have it back for what I paid for it, plus a little extra. Let's call it a convenience fee, shall we? I could, it's mine. but I did pay for it. I'd like to recover my losses. Take that up with the kid. The in the back room, I'd have to walk back there. Then you're the one who said it was junk. If that's true, why well, bother? Pleasure doing business. I was trying to see if we could uh, persuade her, but it didn't seem like there was an option there. I think I have some more stuff I can sell. Well, certainly. I'm gonna use pistols. I don't care. I'm gonna use pistols. Pistols and shotgun. Back to it then. By the terror, by the terror, by the Jesus terror! I can't Christ, believe it. you scared the hell out of me, dude. Is it real? Came out of real nowhere. You, captain of the frontier, bane of the fleet, constellations shine. Oh, 
You are definitely the brightest, biggest star in any constellation. There's no maybe. It's a... I have an eye for these things. Not that you're hot. Although at first, I... But now that I know it's you... But I changed my routine for one day and... Thanks. Thanks for watching. Have a good one. <laughs> I was minding your business as well. Visualizing. Creepy. Either way, it's such an on. Hey, do you mind if I follow you around? Do you, what am I saying? You're a Good point. I'll start working on it right away. Until then, maybe I can be a sidekick in training. If not, I... You won't be... I appreciate your assistance, but I still need all of those sensors. I have them. I really do need that additional data. So you do. I'll just take these. All right. We'll just upload the data. Give it a moment. And just another moment. Oh. It is working, isn't it? You tell me, dude. There it is. I believe. Now, let's see. This is... Well, it's... Oh, my. Well, there's good news. The good news is I will report my findings to Mast immediately. Yeah, trees are to kill everybody. Yep. Well, from a certain point. The bad news... In this particular case, the truth... This is something we've never observed. I must consult with my colleagues in math. Thanks for the two grand. Take that, though. Sensors speaks for itself. Thank you for your help retrieving the biosensors. Okay. Dr. B? I originally had to wait, but now it's just time to check in.
Alright, I think I'm gonna go quit sprinting now anyway. Because we've been playing for almost three hours. Soon, probably. Yeah. 